Well, the 2022 Football World Cup uh, will not be held in the summer months in Qatar. That's according to FIFA's General Secretary, Jerome Valka. The tournament's scheduling has been debated since a controversial decision in 2010 to award the World Cup to the Gulf nation. Temperatures here can uh, reach up to 50 degrees Celsius in June and July, the traditional times that the event is played. Valka is one of the top officials at football's governing body. This is what he had to say to a French radio station. It's not that it's possible, it will happen. Frankly, it will be played between 15th of November and 15th of January at the latest. If you play between 15th of November and the end of December, that's when the weather's most favourable, with an average temperature of 25 degrees. That's perfect for football. And FIFA have issued a short official statement in response to the comments saying the precise event date is still subject to ongoing consultation. No decision will be taken before the 2014 World Cup. Our sports correspondent, Lee Wellings, is live for us in London. Hi there, Lee. So two different lines coming out of FIFA. What should we believe? Yeah, not the first time two separate lines will have come out of FIFA. I mean, Jérôme Volker is an extremely important figure. He's the general secretary. He's effectively the number two to Sepp Blatter. What he says always carries a lot of weight. He often says things quite deliberately, even if they're in an unofficial capacity. But what he said here has obviously created quite a, quite a stir uh, because we're meant to be in a consultation period. That was the whole point in October at FIFA headquarters. The executive committee sat down. We thought they were going to say, yes, there will be a winter World Cup. We'll finally put everyone out of their misery. That decision will be made. But no, they decided it would be better to bring in people from across the European leagues, particularly that are going to be so affected by this. But that consultation period was meant to last throughout um, most of this year, certainly beyond the World Cup in Brazil. And now Joan Volker has come out and said this. Unsurprisingly, FIFA officially very quickly saying, no, it's all about the consultation period. But he's given a very big indication of there of what will actually happen, whatever the consultation. Yeah, it sounds like Jerome Valka's uh, jumped the gun here. What is the position of the Qatar 22, uh, 2022 organisers? You have to have some sympathy for them, don't you? We're, they don't really want to be in the spotlight at this moment. They know it's Brazil's World Cup year. Uh, they've been flexible with everything. They've said that the cooling technology will be there still if you want it played in summer. If you want it in winter, that will be fine. Have your consultation. They've always fallen in line with FIFA. We haven't had an official response yet. And I think that slight delay will be partly because they don't want to have to keep coming out and talking about when they're going to play the World Cup. That's FIFA's decision. I would also say this, that the timing of what Jérôme Volker has had to say. Sepp Blatter's had some difficulties with the Brazil preparations. He's not happy with the lack of progress being made. This is a distraction, isn't it? And I think that suits FIFA just fine.